What's up YouTube, how are you doing today? Chana D, your techno dad here, and in today's video, I got something really quick, just a fresh announcement from Marantz. They got new AVRs, people, new AVRs. And I got the press release info right here, so we're talking about the new 14 series lineup. It's the SR5014 and the SR6014, which are gonna replace the SR5013 and 6013. So you guys know what that means, right? Like I always say, best time to buy an AVR is when the new ones come out and you buy the older one. So if you don't need the features in this one, the new one, you can get a heavily discounted AVR. And if you're a Marantz lover or trying to get into Marantz, then maybe the 6013 or 5013 will be a good way to go. But anyway, today we're gonna be talking about the SR5014 and the SR6014. Now the 5014 comes in at 999. It's a seven channel receiver that will process seven channels and power seven channels. The 6014 is a nine channel receiver that will process 11 channels, but only power nine. And it comes in at 1599. So closest competitor would be the Denon X4500H for the 6014 and the Denon X3500H would be the competitor to the, you know, the 5014. The 5014 will have a power output of 100 watts per channel. That's into eight ohms and it was rated full bandwidth at a harmonic distortion of 0.08%. And that of course is two channels driven. Now the 6014 has a little bump in, in power. It's just 10 more horsepower, I mean, watts per channel, two channels driven. Now, if you're wondering why I'm kind of stumbling over my words, it's because today is a very exciting day here and the Techno Dad channel. Tonight, there's going to be a live stream with the Don Corleone of Home Theater. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, Gene Della Sala from Audioholics will be here on my channel in a live stream tonight, 7 p.m. Pacific, 10 p.m. Eastern, and we will actually be discussing uh, power ratings for AVRs. So that kind of ties into what we're talking about right now. So definitely mark your calendar, stay tuned, and uh, we'll see you there tonight. So for both AVRs, we are getting support for the Enhanced Audio Return Channel, or eARC, which will allow lossless audio to travel from your TV straight to your AVR. And we're also getting support for ALLM, which is the auto low latency mode for gaming consoles such as the Xbox One X. And of course, voice support for Amazon Alexa, Google Assistant, and Apple Siri. As for high res playback, we are getting support for FLAC, WAVE, ALAC, and DSD at 2.8 and 5.6 megahertz. So looking at the comparison chart, you can see we've got eight HDMI inputs on both only two on the 5014 and we got three on the 6014. IMAX enhanced for the 6014 only, not the 5014. Processing for 11 channels on the 6014 and only seven channels on the 5014. Both get the new Dolby Atmos height visualization technology via a firmware update. As for room correction, you do get a slightly better version of Odyssey with the 6014 and something very interesting for those running dual subwoofers. The 5014 is parallel and the 6014 comes independent. So you can set the subwoofers independently of each other and that is a great feature. So as I said in the beginning of the video, the brand new AVRs are coming out, so the older ones will be heavily discounted. And if you've been waiting to get a Marantz AVR at a good price, you might want to look at the 5013 or the 6013. However, if you are looking for the latest and greatest and you got money to put down, the 6014 is probably going to be my pick as it'll process 11 channels, power 9 channels, and give you like a better overall experience with the parallel subwoofers and a better room correction with Odyssey XT32. Now, if you guys are buying an AVR or upgrading this year, let me know which ones you're looking at down in the comments. Of course, if you have any questions, hit me up down there as well. Not down there. Hit me up on whatever social or email if you like. That's pretty much it for this video. Go ahead, smash that like button, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel using the button in the middle of your screen. Once again, my name is Chana D. I'm your techno dad, and I'll see you next time.